Breaking news out of East Toledo. Police have a man in custody after a standoff at Front and Consol Street. We have Sharice Thompson out there live right now with the latest on what happened. Sharice. And Dan, we're told by police that that suspect did surrender to police. This situation is now over and that suspect is now in custody. But it was a pretty uh, hectic scene not too long ago. Police are telling us that that suspect is 33 year old Christopher Laharn. Detectives received a tip that Laharn was inside a home in the 2000 block of Front Street. Now, police have been looking for Laharn. They say he has three active armed robbery warrants. He's wanted in a series of armed Armed robberies in which he brandished a firearm and threatened to kill the employees inside. Uh, neighbors were told that they could not get to their homes because police had to set up a perimeter. Negotiators were here on the scene to try and coax uh, the suspect out. Fortunately, they were able to do that, and police are now saying that this they're happy this whole thing just ended peacefully without anyone getting hurt. And that's exactly what we want. Uh, we, we work for the peaceful resolutions. We have SWAT on standby in, in case, uh, you know, the situation deteriorates and in case we need to go inside. But uh, really negotiations are key and uh, that appears to have, have worked in this case, which is, is exactly what we wanted. <clears throat> Laharn would now be taken to the Lucas County Jail to face charges. As for residents who live here, police say that they can now get back to their homes, that that perimeter has been lifted. Uh, police have left the scene, but there are a few uh, police cars still here uh, just in case. But the situation here has ended. That, that gunman, suspected gunman, is in police custody. 33-year-old Christopher Laharn now at the Lucas County Jail to face the charges for a series of aggravated armed robberies. We're live in Toledo. Sharice Thompson. WTOL 11. Sharice.